hi guys welcome back to my channel did i like literally last night cut off two inches of my own hair yes yes i did um am i regretting it a little bit but i mean it didn't turn out too bad this is just naturally how my hair looks um it naturally wavy so you can't even tell if it's bad or not so Okay, so what is this video? This video is an update on my deck of panning. Um, it's really depressing guys. It's that time of the year where it's getting darker in the evenings now. So it's 6pm. Sun is pretty much already set. So this lighting is going to become the norm now. We're going to have no more like natural light probably until like March next year because I rarely have the time to film during the day unless I have time on a weekend which is quite rare let's do an update on my deck of panning so deck of panning if you guys have been following along already this year you guys should know what it is um it's pretty plain and simple you use a deck of cards there is a uh table that's updated every month on a spreadsheet made by Emily and Max and it has the prompts on it related to the cards that's pretty much it I kind of decided when I started doing this that I would um, roll in a new item every month even if I didn't hit any goals turn my phone on silent I have no idea what that accent was so firstly we have got this this is my Versace Women fragrance this is my first ever perfume that I bought actually when I was like 16 and I'm now 31 so take that into your brain um we are now I don't know it's gonna be really hard for you guys to see I think I have got like a gold uh marker at the very very bottom within the pink area we have now reached like just below it you can probably see it just underneath there um I used it seven times this month a total of 65 times this year I rolled this in in January for the prompt fragrance so yeah it is i think probably going to be finished um next month i would say because we haven't got very much left like the dome the bottom of this is domed like this so there's going to be less products that i can pick up throughout the month i also now have to put it on a tilt now when i spray because when i do a spray like this nothing comes out because of the little ending is like slanted out of the um liquid so hopefully next month we will have a finished item which is very exciting next we have got this this is my MUA undressed your skin uh highlighter in the shade iridescent gold it is looking like this uh this is in for the prompt pattern and as you can see we've still got a pattern you can see it's kind of like rubbing away like up here it's just like these big bits down here which are just impossible to get away because they are so huge but uh, we're, we're making some slow progress i definitely think at the end of this year i will probably do like a finale and then restart in january probably go on until finale obviously i won't be rolling this out before december so um yeah I'm actually looking forward to the finale so that I can stop working on this because I have been working on this for the full year. Uh, seven times this month, a total of 69 times this year. Very excitingly, we've got my next item which is my Laura Rock palette. And this month we did hit pan relatively early on. So I only used this five times this month, a uh, total of 31 times since I rolled it in in March so it still took me a while but 31 times is not too bad actually for me and if I show you guys it was for the prompt colour generator I had to roll in a green shade that looked similar to this green here and as you can see we have hit pan on it that is 100% being rolled out and right this instant next up is a fail I would say it is this. This is my coconut oil strong root spray. The goal is to use this 10 times. I have used it only once this last month, total of six times in this project. So the way this is going, I foresee me not reaching my goal by the end of this year. 
which I'm actually okay with. I don't really use this very much. I am going to officially roll this out today. This is my NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the shade Rome. It looks like this with this, you know, it looks exactly the same as it does on the tin. Um, I'm actually wearing it today on my lips. I used it nine times now, so I used it five times this last month. My, my goal was to reach it ten times, and so I'm definitely going to be reaching that this month. I don't want it to be just hanging around for a month, not being rolled out, so I am officially rolling it out. Alright, I was just um, editing this, and I realised like I forgot two things. I already filmed one thing. The other thing is this. This is my Guerlain bronzer with the dip, as you can see. Not reached my goal yet. I used it four times this month for a total of 29 times. But yeah, there we go. Hi, this is just an afterthought. I just realised and forgot that I had this rolled in last month, which is my Ginger Souffle Red Body Cream. I used this zero times last month and I forgot it was even rolled into the project so we'll pick this back up again so I'm going to roll in two new items today um, as I said I use ooh, this I haven't actually looked at the um, prompts yet I will obviously put a screenshot of it when I roll them in let me just get the game sheet up let me also, whilst I'm here, um, shuffle the cards whilst I explain. Um, if there are any prompts that I'm looking at that I can't really work with, I will just re-pick up a new card. The idea is you don't want to get the Joker in this project, because if you do, then you have to roll in an Are You Joking item, and that's something that you seriously do not want to work on. Work on. So that's something like a black eyeliner, or no, for me it would be like an eyeliner. Black eyeshadow, red lip product, you know, those things you just don't necessarily reach for. And you just don't really like using very much. Um, the face cards, you know, the Ace, King, Jack and Queen. Um, the red and black both have different goals and they stay the same every month. So it's just the number cards from um, 1 to 10 that change every single month. Four of hearts. Veto. <sighs> Veto. Okay, that means I can remove one item and replace it with something else. Two of spades. I think I have an idea of what I want to roll in. It might make my life a little bit difficult, but let's do it anyway i just looked at the rules so the way that i veto is i kick a product out so the product i'm actually going to remove is this and i'm going to roll in something different so that is a queen of hearts so when i go to the game board queen of hearts project graveyard so this is an item I have panned or like neglected but want to pick up again and like work on a little bit more so let me go through and have a look to see what I can find. I hope that made sense. That's your birthstone which is ruby. I am now back so as I said I have vetoed this spray because I know I won't finish it and to replace it i have replaced this this is my nars orgasm um and it looks like this it's already got pan on it so this is why it's in the project graveyard i want to use this 10 times and then i'll roll it out again i just want to use it a little bit more, a little bit more i do love this blush so i just want to have some more love into it. I'm not using very many blushes at the moment, so I thought, why not utilise that? Hello? Hello? Okay, that's good. <laughs> My phone just went off. Hello? Yes, it is. Item I rolled in for my birthstone 
is this eyeshadow. So my birthstone's ruby, and the only thing I could think of was this shade here, down here, which is Cherry Cordial. Like, it's kind of similar to, a, like, a birthstone shade of mine. Um, so I'm gonna roll that one in. And I don't think I'll try and hit pan on it. I'll just use it as much as I can this year. Um, I know I won't be able to reach pan on it, knowing how I worked on previous uh, Too Faced eyeshadows and this take months. So I'm just going to work on it as much as I can and see how I go. Um, so I'm rolling out the, the lip product, I'm rolling out the Lorac eyeshadow and I'm rolling out this but only rolling in two new items to replace them. I hope that made sense. Anyway, that is my update. I apologise for the random phone call in the middle and I shall see you guys next time. Bye guys.